What's happening guys? We're back and today's a big day. All right, so today's a big day. We're gonna get rid of the build table, make some space. Um, we've come to the point now where we don't need it anymore. It's more of a hindrance than it is a help. Um, so we're gonna disassemble the build table, slide it up against the wall, kind of put it up flat like a credit card. Hopefully it won't take up any space. Um, and then we're gonna rearrange the shop a little bit. Uh, it's a friggin' disaster zone right now. I got parts everywhere. Um, I've been fabricating parts for the deck over the last week, so I got stuff for that all over the place. We're gonna get rid of it all, um, organize a little bit, and then uh, hopefully get the car up on the stands that we built last week. And then, uh, yeah, make a bit of space. I wanna bring my street bikes back. It's summertime, it's time to ride those things. So, yeah, it's gonna be, uh, be a lot of cleaning, a lot of organizing, and hopefully the shop's gonna look better when we're done. So, let's uh, crack on. All right, we got halfway kind of cleaned up in here. Um, far enough that we can start disassembling the table. So we're gonna pop the top off. The top is the only part that we can't store outside because it's MDF. Um, as soon as MDF gets wet, it swells up and gets all mushy and it's just garbage. So we're gonna keep the top over there where there's zero space. Um, and then all the other parts are just gonna get stored outside. Uh, I'm pretty sure we didn't glue anything together, so hopefully all we got to do is find all the screws, pop them out, and uh, rip it all apart. Then we'll have some room to work. different view from down here <laughs> this thing is gonna be little so I put it up on just the ride height blocks just to see uh, see how low it actually is we've never had the car on the ground so uh, it's a whole nother view from down here um, but the goal is always if I was sitting at a red light and I saw a penny on the ground I could I could pick it up so I think we've achieved that now we will Try to figure out how to get this thing up on those stands. It's gonna be a bit of a gong show, but we'll do it. So, let's go.
Now comes the tricky part. We need to jack the whole thing up high enough to slide those stands under the wheels. And I don't have a jack that goes that high. So it's gonna be a whole bunch of blocking and kind of lifting it in segments, but we'll figure it out. That was incredibly nerve-wracking getting it jacked up that high. I had to put my jack stand on top of my jack, um, kind of leaning tower of Pisa my way up. But we got them up, so the rear end is sitting on its stands. Um, the front end obviously isn't because we don't have shock mounts there yet. Um, but that's going to be next week's episode is we're going to try to do the shock mounts for the front end. So I'm going to call it an episode here guys. Um, we got the rear end up. I'm pretty proud of that. The build table's out of the way. I'm going to spend some time now and kind of clean up around here, um, do a little organizing, and then we'll catch up with you guys next week. So, in the meantime, thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, hit the like and subscribe button. Go check us out on Instagram, Left Foot First Media, and we'll see you next week. I'm out of here.